Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Today, I'll be talking about an inspiration that I had, you know, while I was driving. And the thought is, let us pass over. This, this is taken from Mark chapter 4. And I'll just read from verse... 35 and the same day when the even was come he said unto them let us pass over on the other side if i take it up a couple of verses it says and with many such parables spake he the word unto them as they were able to hear it but without a parable speak he not unto them and when they were alone he expounded all things to his disciples the key verse is and he said and the same day when the evening was come he said unto them let us pass over on the other side and when they had sent away the multitude they took him even as he was in the ship and there were also with him other little ships and there arose a great storm of wind and the waves beat into the ship so that it was now full what i want us to get today is the fact that it says let us pass over we may look at situation and say why do i need to pass over but there was a great need that they passed over it was a great need to get onto the other side we may wonder sometimes we're going in a period of uncertainty that we don't know what really is on the other side but unless we venture out then we can't know for sure what is on the other side i remember the children of israel when god gave them the commission when he wanted them to get out of egypt and he promised them the promised land they had no idea what they were getting into they didn't know what they would see they didn't know what will be there but the fact of the matter is that god says get out of egypt get out of egypt and i will bring you into a land that's flowing with milk and honey and there is also another bible character you know when when lot left solomon gomorrah to get onto the other side he didn't know where he was going but the lord says come on out of Sodom and Gomorrah. Why? Because there was danger impending in that city. And I think about Abraham, where the Lord instructed him and say, get thee up from among your kindred. So there are times when we need to move out of the ordinary, when we need to move from the base things, where we need to pass over what are we passing over we are passing over depression we are passing over on the other side we're leaving behind some stuff some weight that we can't take on the other side we are dropping off all those things that will be a hindrance to us what is on your other side what are you leaving behind that you need to pass over so i would say on what is on the other side? There is a great blessing on the other side. There is deliverance on the other side. But we will never know that if we allow fear to keep us in the forsaken position that we might find ourselves in. So when we are talking about our other side, we are talking about getting on the other side where we can find our joy leaving the base things behind us and moving forward where we're pressing towards the mark of the higher calling this life is temporary this life is only for a moment so we must need go on the other side you know when when god said to them let us pass over on the other side i can imagine that they didn't want to move and sometimes when we are to move from one place to the other place from the base things into even a greater revelation of god sometimes we don't want to move because why we may have some stuff in our lives that we hold dear to. There's some things in our life that we hold on to and we don't want to let it go. But today, whatever be our hindrance, whatever is holding us back, let us pass over. Let us get over it. Sometimes I look at it as a hurdle. 
and sometimes sorry i look at it as a hurdle we need to jump over it whatever is restraining us we need to jump over it and when we have gotten over it we are on the other side and when we have made it to the other side we are not going to allow the same situation that was back there the situation that we have left way over in egypt we're not going to let it hinder our breakthrough now that we have made it over.